Hey, it's Rich back with you for another video. Today I'm with a 2008 Cessna Turbo 206. It's the H model, current production, it's still in production. And this airplane has a lot of uh, nice upgrades, air conditioning. We'll tell you all about them in a flight we're gonna take out to Cable Airport. We're gonna take you along for the ride. Clear. Good take off two six left, five zero zero three Lima. We'll do a short field takeoff and then see if we can be airborne. Thousand foot marker. Yeah, banner for Papa. Let's do the banner drop this time. Papa, Papa, Roger. Extend. I'm gonna call base. Extend. Down one. You'll call the base. Thanks for Papa. Uh, Papa. You're really. Uh... Oh yeah, all good. Okay, Cessna 206 obviously has been around for a long time. I think probably the 60s was the first uh, variant and made them continuously up through 1985, 1986. And I've always been real popular uh, utility airplanes. Used in Alaska, third world countries, really good, uh, uh, useful load. And then didn't make any piston airplanes at Cessna from 86 to 96 basically started to uh, make piston engine airplanes again. They brought back the 172, the 182, and the, tur and the 206, and turbo 206. And that was the H model, which is what this is, 2009. And they're still in production today. I think they're yeah, HD, where they upgraded the gross weight. It used to be 3,600 pounds standard, now it's 38. But this airplane with tip tanks has a 3,800 pound gross weight. But again, the 206 was just a, and it remains a really good utility airplane. When I, we were a dealer for Cessna, we sold a lot of turbo 206s. Um, six seats, and we're getting 140 knots at 3,000 feet right now. Get up higher, you get 100, probably 60 knots. Uh, really, just a great airplane. I think a 27,000 foot service ceiling. This one has G1000 upgraded, but the tur tur uh, 206s, turbo 206s, over the years have just been really, really solid uh, airplanes. This airplane is a 2009 turbo 206H, and this has a lot of upgrades. It's a customer uh, that, that, that keeps his airplane with us at OCR Aviation, and uh, a lot of upgrades, NXI, uh, which is a really nice upgrade. This has tip tanks. It has the Keith uh, air conditioning system. It's got VGs. Um, really well-equipped airplane. We were just commenting on how nice and cold this uh, Keith air conditioning. I don't think they make Keith air conditioners anymore for these airplanes. Now they're Kelly's uh, thermocool system, which is electric, and this is engine-driven. But this is a great, uh, great air conditioner. And uh, just this is... Uh, a good example of, uh, you know, the A model 206, and very popular in the market right now, which I've mentioned in other videos, uh, across the board, how uh, how strong demand is for good, clean, uh, used airplanes, new airplanes, all the manufacturers are sold out, 
of new airplanes. The volume, of course, of production is down, but still there's a lot of buyers in the market. And uh, uh, we have a customer shopping for a 206 right now like this, but it's hard to find anything So it's just a really strong market, and we've, uh, we've actually done really well marketing airplanes through YouTube as well and uh, getting what we think are some really premium prices for airplanes. And still the buyers feel like it's good value and we're just getting a lot of, of uh, positive results from doing flights like this on YouTube so people really see the airplane, learn a little bit about each specific airplane so it's really a good uh, venue to, to highlight airplanes on. As I mentioned, you know, with this strong market, uh, if, if you're thinking about selling an airplane, really in any category, uh, we, our serve, we, we cover a wide variety of airplanes from single engine airplanes, trainers, all the way up to uh, owner flown business jets, caravans, Kodiaks, you know, turboprops, King Airs. If you have an airplane that you're trying to sell and you're not getting uh, good action on it, or you're thinking about selling an airplane, you kind of want to know what the what the value is in this market, you know, you can you reach out to us. I think our email is sales at ocraviation.com. Uh, give us a call and we can give you an idea what your airplane's worth. Zero three Lima, thank you. Um, it's really a good time if you're not getting, if we've come across some people recently that aren't using their airplane as much. It's just a really good time to sell or at least sample the market, see what, see what your airplane's worth. So please, uh, you know, reach out to us and uh, you don't pay anything on a commission until uh, until we sell the airplane, so there's no obligations, and we uh, even feature it on the YouTube channel. So, anyway, just if you're interested uh, and have any questions about that, don't hesitate to give a call. Uh, we're going to start our way down into uh, Cape for for uh, for some lunch. Cape traffic check four four is left out with a beat number six. Cape traffic. And the two six has both uh, both of you guys in sight. And uh, we'll be number three for runway six cable. I don't think that guy wants to uh, to four. Uh, cable traffic eight, three eight seven Charlie turning towards the dam. We'll make an entry for left traffic runway six. Okay. Cable traffic turning towards the dam. Didn't say if he was touching go, did he? Must be using two thousand for the pattern. Two of six is midfield left downwind for runway six. Cable traffic seven one zero left base six for cable. Two of six is turn left base for runway six cable. Cable traffic one two Juliet Cherokee will hold short runway six until that last test is down. It's final look. Looks clear. Better, Evan. Yeah, I want my best work. Is this guy gonna be a uh, full stop? Probably. 206 is final, runway 6. Cherokee 1 2 Julia holding short, runway 6. Nice job, dude. I figure I guess I can go for one more lap, Scott. Let's do it. 206 is short, final, runway 6. We'll be a full stop. Cable traffic, Cherokee 8387, Charlie, turning inbound from the dam, 3000, down for 2.5, left traffic, 6, cable. Traffic traffic, Cable traffic, one two Juliet departing runway. Gonna go for lunch. Traffic. How much time? Yeah. Traffic. Yeah, I got traffic. Yeah, I got time. One seven two Romeo Whiskey. We're over Fritz Valley. Five thousand five hundred. Going to be entering left traffic for runway two three. Full stop. Give traffic. All right, we're back on the ground at Long Beach. I hope you enjoyed the quick flight in this Turbo two hundred six H, and thanks for watching. <laughs>